Torn up you and the arse that you rolled over it Burn them till they turn it to smoke and talk and they disappear Good lads, stick a flag in money in my memory And burn the effigy that resembles my arch enemy I'm on stage with a face like a bag of spanners Burning greed and it tastes like wagamamas Burn up a heathen, got your paint peeling Strata got more size than the door that is dangerous There's this strategy, broken English Manx on tour 3013 This is the drum and bass diaries and check me in Dub Physics, proper knobhead, at Genesis Nights in June, innit? See. I think we're up there. I think, obviously, the thing with London is they're quite, um, without being controversial, educated, I'd like to say, yeah. So they know a lot about the music and stuff, so they take a lot more. Um, I don't know, there's a lot more thinking about it, do you know what I mean? Whereas sometimes in other cities they just do and just go sick and that. A lot of the time in London they're listening and, you know, taking it in in a different way. So like I was saying to you before, sometimes in London when you're doing a set, it feels like it's not going off that much. But then when you come off, everyone's like, oh, I proper enjoyed it and that's what I mean. That's good. Oh, the process of getting booked. Uh, you, well, I get a call off George saying we might have a show there at this date, you gotta come and play at it. And then I usually go, yeah. And then put it in my calendar and that, and then everything, his agent sorts everything out between us, and then we end up, we end up here, that's what I mean. Yeah, nah, a couple, not stranded as such, but when guys don't come through, not so much anymore, because I'm quite professional now, but in the early days of my career, when I first started going out and I was taking care of my own bookings, ended up in some mad gaps, and uh, yeah, these days, people are pretty much on it. Got a few horror stories, but along for another time, you know. Spontaneous, like I don't really know what George is gonna play, and he don't really know what I'm gonna say. That's good. I think um, I think it's much more fun. Like that. If you know this, the, it's proper structured. After a while of doing the same set, it's going to be boring. But sometimes, you know, you just surprise each other what you're doing and buzz off it that way. <laughs> All right. Well, uh, I have a bottle of brandy, and uh, George has a bottle of brandy and a Kinder Egg. And everywhere he goes, he get a Kinder Egg on the rider. And in his studio he's got enough different toys and he'll tell you that oh yeah that one's from Warsaw and that one's from this and that. But I gotta complain about today. When we got here, they didn't get um the Kinder eggs, they got a pipe full of Cadbury's cream eggs, and that is not the same thing, so you're slipping, I'm not happy with tonight. And also as well as that, I had six lagers on my rider and I was like supposed to get in a bottle of brandy and the guy said you can trade them in six lagers for four brandies and coats. But that's not even gonna touch the sides anyway, so I'm upset tonight. A rider didn't come through, but as well for in Europe, you have to put on your on your uh, rider cabbage, and that means weed in Europe. Do you know what I mean? So I have cabbage on mine as well, but sometimes I've never had an actual cabbage. Sometimes you don't get weed either. Ah, <laughs> uh, yeah, it's a bit away yet. Do you know what I mean? But um, obviously, I know you and that, so just looking forward to coming down, playing somewhere new and meeting some new people, that's what I like. That's the thing about music, you know, I enjoy that coming down and doing sets and that, but I'm a people person, I like to go out, like discover the city that I'm in and meet new people and that's what I'm looking forward to the most. But is it round here, is it in here? One word, one bit of advice, fucking eh. Fucking sort my rider out. <laughs> Uh, nah, no, no, you know what, just push the music that you love and try and uh, don't get set in booking the same people over and over, look for something new, do you know what I mean? You see the same lineups all the time on different rays and that, and it's good and that, but yeah, I don't know man, just push the music that you love and see what happens, isn't it?